Guys, watch this catapult shot. It's literally going to be the best one you've ever seen in your life. All right, watch this. Oh, shoot. Sorry, Clay. So, I mean, obviously that wasn't one of my better moments on the catapult, but in this video, we're going to go over how you can go from accidentally murdering your entire team to getting mega kills with the catapult. So stick around and we'll go over some tips on how to do that. Okay, so in this short clip, what you're about to witness is the mass destruction of our entire team. If you do not use the zoom feature on the catapult, like if you can't see from a distance that far away to the castle gates, if you can't tell between red or blue, make sure you use the zoom feature. On PC, it's right click. If you're on console, it's left trigger, but use it so that way you don't end up killing your entire team on the objective. At this point, I'm going to assume that you've mastered the zoom feature and we're going to move on to tip number two, which is to use the arrow camera to follow the rock. If you want to get better, follow the rock to see what kind of distance you get with each drawback of the catapult arm. Although it might seem very cool to be constantly shooting at the objective because you're like, haha, I'm going to get a lot of points. I'm going to kill a lot of people. Well, shooting directly at the objectives is great and all until you're the reason why your team doesn't make it past the gates at Lion's Fire. I would suggest that instead of shooting directly at the objective and bombarding your teammates, aim for where you know the enemy is going to spawn. Fun fact, you can actually shoot a rock over the walls in Lion's Fire and hit the left spawn if you are on the catapult. The enemy team is going to hate you for it and they will probably call you out in chat. But do you care? No, you are a catapult master and you know that you should be shooting at the spawn waves and not directly on top of an objective when you see 12 of your teammates there. You might think that the catapults are really only great for attack, but that is not true. That is not true. Catapults are great for defense. If you are on a map like the Siege of Rudhelm, for instance, you can actually turn the catapult around if you're on Mason's side and point it at the Agathian spawn and you can blow up their entire spawn wave just by simply rotating the catapult and using it against them. All right, well, that pretty much covers my catapult video. So if you have any questions, leave them below in the comments. Make sure to leave a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And if you have time, we are live Monday through Friday and sometimes on the weekend on Twitch at 11 Central Standard Time in the morning. Thank you guys for watching.